okay so i get this feeling that many people don't know how to get to the description tab on youtube so how do you do this once you click on any video okay i'll pause this you want to click on the title of the video that will bring out the description panel so the description box will tell you what the video is actually about or if the publisher wants you to get any other information like an app link or a donation or something so for example in this video i share the link where you can get the funds pack and also let's move to the comment section this is where you can write whatever thing you want the publisher to know if there is any question or anything whatsoever so that will be all this tutorial starts in three two one action Babe, what's up with the 5k you promised me? Ah uh ah, -uh, babe, how far? I will give you now. Ah uh ah. -uh. Ah, but babe, me will no like. You do like money, oh. Mm. Me will shall listen to this advert. Don't take this serious. What you're about to hear is not real. This is just me trying to be creative. Hey, 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 hey. Better I wish Don Lando Choco Graphics Studio presents its 3 days smartphone graphics design class whereby you will learn cool stuff like 3D mock-up design, video and picture animation, how to design a flyer, creating a business card, picture manipulation, photo editing, video editing, advert placement, and so on. They go, they go like that. The coolest thing we say, all this offer is available for just 3,000 naira. Where she can money, the venue, now close WhatsApp group. To participate or inquire about this amazing class, send a DM to the number displaying on your screen right now. What are you waiting for? Take this offer now. Oh, babe, I don't think I can give you that money again. Why not just let's register and learn this thing once and for all? Then we'll make more money from there. What do you think? Really? So, where do you expect me to get money to fix my hair? I need to fix my nails. I need to change wardrobe and all you could tell me is you want to register to be a graphics designer. Sure? Now 5 k you won't take you to do all this one where you mention? Ah, mado. You know what I'm out. Good luck with your learning. Hi guys, it's Daniel here again and in today's tutorial, I'll be showing you an app that is widely used by professionals to create animated videos and this is Plotagon. Mind you, people go as far as paying thousands of naira to learn about these apps alone and to me i would say it is a good idea because i personally believe that whatsoever thing you learn with your money you are going to value it more and you are going to take it more serious than any other thing in reality you are not paying money but you are paying with your time and i want to try as much as possible not to waste your time because i totally i seriously appreciate you guys i i appreciate you that's all yeah so when you open the app this is what you're going to be welcomed with and first of all let's go to the settings like i always do but in this app there is nothing much to talk about okay if you want to purchase your subscription if you want to manage content if you want to restore purchases here is where you can do all that and you can choose your dark or light settings if you want i prefer dark all right you can change the language but i am a nigerian i speak english i don't know about this all right so let's go back and mind you some of the contents in this app are not free if you just want to make a video for yourself advertising your business or you just want to use the app you're good to go with the free package but if you want to turn this into a full-time job if you want to be doing this for people then it is advisable at least to let them get value for their money for what you're doing just get some premium temp so let's dive into the app you want to go and create video let's go let's go on and create a new video so when you press on this beach here you'll be welcomed with all the scenes that are available for you to use so just go through them and choose the one that suits the video you want to produce so let's see okay i want to use this ballroom i am just going to be scratching the surface so you can see what and how exactly this app works so now it will ask you to choose your actor and now what this red light means is, is that the app cannot process your request that means there is an error somewhere just like in java language whereby if you impute anything that the computer cannot process it is going to flash in red it's the same thing as this so now let's go on and choose our actor 
so these are the actors you can choose from i have some that i already used before here so let's so let's go on and create our own okay now we are in what the fuck is this <laughs> okay so this is what you want to do you can choose random and you can manually create your character yourself let's say i want to create a female make it big okay so this is a random image now and if there's anything you want to change here this is the head this is for the hair this is the mustache the eyeball accessories and this is the top this is the shorts the trouser okay so let, let me change this one okay. mm, let me change the skin if you want to change the color of the skin you can do that here right let me see the boots Okay, so this is for the voice. This is where you can choose how you want the voice to sound. How do I sound? Okay, and the last one here is the mustique. It's actually for male characters. How do I sound? Okay, all right. So I'll be choosing. Let's see this one. How do I sound? And here is where you can impute the name. You can change it to anything you want to. And the last one here is where you can change the background. Maybe if you want to save this avatar on your phone. So this button here stands for the mode. The mode you want your character to be in when taking the picture. As you can see. This camera icon is if you want to take the picture. So yes. Something like that. And if you want to share it, go right and do that. So I would just save this. Okay, so don't forget we are here to choose our character. And we've just created a new character called gift so let me choose gift here okay so this is gift and here you can select where you want her to be if you want her to stand by the door if you want her to stand in the middle by the left you can do that also okay so let me say she's standing at the window side let's see how that will look like okay so i want to select the new character Okay, this is so cool okay let's see so this button here is the create a new scene button you can use that to change the scene don't forget we are using a ballroom now so we don't need this for now and this button here is for your text if you want to write out the text this is the sound this button here is the action button but since they are not in contact with each other they cannot act on each other so this one here is the music button and this one here is the text button if you want to create a black background with the text on we'll see everything in a bit so first of all let me just say say you can record with this button here okay so let's let's listen to this hey there i'm gift and you are all right i want to write the text let's go back to gifts there's something i want to show you here so this button here is the mode this is where you can change how you want the actor to deliver his or her line let's say um okay let's say i'm happy and shoko here is super excited now why should i be surprised okay let's say i'm um, happy to sigh all right so let's play this out and listen to everything hey there i'm gift and you are i'm daniel but you can call me shoko wow i'm what what is i'm daniel but you can call me shoko okay let's just manage that for now so this camera button here is where you want the angle of the camera to be let's click on that and if i should skip establishing so that means it will just dive in into the dialogue straight away it would not show me anything let's see that hey there i'm gift and you are as you can see started the dialogue immediately and if i tell it to establish shots there will be some 
Hey there, I'm as Gift and you are. As you can see, there was a slight movement or let's say freeze frame before the dialogue started. So if I see move forward and I play this. Hey there, I'm Gift and you are. I'm Daniel, but you can call me Shogun. As you can see, the camera was moving forward and I can change the direction of where the camera is actually moving from and where it is moving to. So let's leave that for now. Let's go and okay, let me create a new sound. Let's just say doorbell. Doorbell, okay. So in natural sense, the doorbell should ring first before the actor start talking. So in order to move this up, there's this three button here, and this is where you can move it up or you can move it down if you want. So if I should play this, this is how it is going to sound. Hey there, I'm Gift and you are. I'm Daniel, but you can call me Shogo. Right, so that is actually good. But you can move it down if you want to, but this doesn't make sense. So the doorbell is supposed to ring first. Okay. Hey there, I'm Gift and you are. I'm Daniel, but you can call me Shogo. Alright. So that is good you can put music if you want so again let's let's just keep all this and let's create a new text let's say they met there that was the scene where the two of them actually met and let's say five years later and here you can change where you want the text to appear maybe left or right or center and this sound will help you to deliver the line. Let's see who has a tick for Santa Claus. Yes. So now let's create another scene. Let's just imagine they know each other now. They are actually close. So let's say TV so far. All right. Don't forget I told you that the red button will strike if there's an error in the script or if there's something the application does not understand so this is just a scene nobody's there let's put a actor there okay let's say gifts and shoko so now the scene is complete notice that since shoko is sitting at the right gifts cannot sit at the right also as you can see see it's blinking red. that means there's an there's an error so let's just go back so as you can see the action button is now available because they are actually close and they can't come in contact with each other so let's just go and see what that does so let's say shoko act on gifts and these are the list of everything they can do well they met five years ago so i guess they are friends now so let's just say i kiss shy all right so let's let's play this from the top to see exactly what we've done so far and that will be the end of the video hey there i'm gift and you are i'm daniel but you can call me shoko five years later and now the last thing we'll be talking about is how to export by clicking here and choose render video it will ask you do you want to export with subtitle or export without subtitle the subtitles are generated automatically based on whatsoever thing you write out all these that i've written here hello and bill that's what is going to write as our subtitle so yes we've come to the end of this video let me know what you think about this in the comments box and if you are new to this channel make sure you subscribe because more content will be coming and if you have any question or comments or anything you want to tell me talk to me in the comments box i really appreciate you guys thank you for watching until next time i come your way stay safe